popping. Everything is popping. Cardi B, she been come to me for six years. I love her, she's so humble, she's so loyal, and she's so nice with everybody. Above the traffic and commerce on this Bronx street lives a queen. My name is Jenny Bui. Uh, people call me Queen Upling. For more than 20 years, Jenny Bowie has been creating jewel-encrusted, over-the-top nail artistry. I get into nail in the beginning. I go to the beauty, um, you know, for hair school, and I have my cosmetology license. But I think about hair is not my type, and I go to all different nail salons to, to just stand there and look at people. I practice on myself and my first customer I try like two and a half hour and they they say they sleep and they wake up I still do it and now they curse me out. I keep going, keep going because I know I have to feed my, my kid, you know. I had three kids that time and work hard because I'm a single mother that time. One of my friends in Japan, she sent me uh, one book about, you know those books is a lot of bling. And I say, oh, maybe I should try that because nobody in the United States they do that. And for real, nobody do that since then. How you doing? Good, how are you? Good. I have clients since 20 years ago. They follow me too. They follow me everywhere I go. And my clients, I'm their therapy also. Sometimes they come and they're not happy with their family, their husband. I convince them not to divorce. The customer come to me, they always say, oh, Jenny, I trust you. I do whatever you want. So I do more bling. But life didn't always sparkle for Jenny. She was born in Cambodia and fled the oppressive Khmer Rouge regime as a child. My childhood is really bad, you know, like, it's really bad, like, I have no food, no nothing, since, since I'm five to, to nine, and I have no shelter to live, nothing, I just live at the air and raining, and we don't have shoes, we don't have clothes to wear, we don't have toothbrush, and we don't have nothing to eat. I live in Cambodia and then I go to Thailand. But her troubles didn't end when she fled to Thailand. Her new home was in an area riddled with deadly landmines. They dropped me at the mountain and that mountain is, hot, is all bomb. That time I only like young, like eight, nine years old, but I feel so bad. And you walk, you step wrong spot, you die because it's a lot of bomb in that mountain. But I worked so hard to get today. Very hard. That's why I want my kid to get good life. Don't have the life like me. I never go vacation. I work hard for my all my kids. Jenny arrived in New York City in 1990. This is my room. Let me show you. So Jenny, Queen of Bling. And today she has two nail studios where she serves her clients, which includes celebrities like Cardi B. Cardi, she worked very hard to get today. I see her, she cannot eat, she's too tired, and she keeps going, she don't give up. She gonna give up. Even she have migraine, she have headaches, she still work. And I asked her, what kind of nail you like? She say, I want a lot of bling and, and a lot of crazy stuff on my nail. Because this is the first time I do for her, so I don't know what she like. So she tell me like that, and then I put cupcake, ice cream, and bling on her nail. Aside from her clients, Jenny has more than 700,000 followers on Instagram who get major manicure inspo from her. I have to say thank you to Yandy Smith. She in VH1 Lap Hip Hop. She the one that crazy with my stuff in the beginning. She come to me and she say, oh my God, Jenny, you're so talented. Why you don't put your talent in the Instagram? 
And the beginning, I don't know what is Instagram. So my Instagram follower, you know, some some of them love me, some of them hate me. So I will say thank you to all my haters too. You don't have haters, you end popping, right? That's why my my little one tell me she nine years old. I say, baby, why mommy always have haters? I say, mommy, you don't have haters, you end popping, and I'm laughing. <laughs> She also has her own line of nail products. Beer nail tits. If you guys want your stones to last longer, this is what you need to get. Jenny's secret. So everybody want to know about my secret. So I create my secret with uh, crystal adhesive and um, crystal gel. The crystal gel is for the big stone. And then the crystal adhesive is for the small stone. They have number two and number one. And number one is for, you know, you put the glue and then the crystal. And number two is for dry the glue. It lasts for three to five weeks. While her work takes her all over the world, Jenny says the Bronx will always be home. I always stay in the Bronx. I love the Bronx. People always think, oh, the Bronx is so scary, but I live in the Bronx for 30 years and nothing happened to me even one time. And she has advice for women entrepreneurs. People give you problems, just, just hold it. And then smiling with them, you know, like, and people cuss you out, just say, have a nice day. I try to tell them, you know, be patient and work hard, be humble and be loyal. I feel very fancy. I've never felt this fancy before. Jenny is a true artist. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Montalbano.